Hello, year three. So here I have got some different shapes, okay? And our aim today is to think about right angles. And we talked about those yesterday. We said they were kind of a perfect L shape and you can kind of use your hand to try and find, it's not perfect, but while we're at home, it's good enough. Okay, it's the perfect L shape and it's 90 degrees. Okay, so first of all, how can you recognize a right angle in any of these shapes? Obviously, you're looking for that kind of perfect L shape, aren't you? Um, so if you're looking in these shapes, what parts of these shapes could show you an angle? Okay, that might be a tricky question, but what parts? So I'm looking for the corners, aren't I? I'm looking at corners for an angle. Okay, because that's the easiest um, place to look. So which shapes here do you think cannot show me a right angle? I'm hoping there are some really obvious ones. Some of them are a bit trickier. So which ones will not have a right angle? I'm hoping you're shouting things like circle because it's only got one line, hasn't it? One edge. There's no place where two lines meet to create an angle. And also the oval is a really obvious one. The other ones are slightly trickier. Okay, now then, I have kind of made myself a right angle finder here. This is 90 degrees. Okay, it's a rectangle. And rectangles all corners are 90 degree angles same as squares they are always 90 degree angles and just to, so here's my l here's my 90 degrees i'm going to put it in the corner and check yeah it fits perfectly and it will do for all i'm really sorry if this is small and quite hard to see for corners okay showing you that each corner is 90 degrees same with my square every corner hoping you can see that Okay, every corner is 90 degrees. We know the circle isn't, we know the oval isn't, hasn't got a 90 degree angle. Okay, what about the triangle? Okay, I've put it over, it's difficult to see, but you can see that it's smaller than 90 degrees. Okay, some triangles will have a 90 degree angle, this one, however, doesn't. Okay, and I'll put it there, so you've got to put it on line with, and you can see that if it had a 90 degree angle, this line should be up here. Okay, so this triangle doesn't. Um, let's try the octagon. I'll match it so that's my line. It doesn't because it goes that way. Okay, so we can see that that doesn't have any 90 degree angles. Let's have a look at the rhombus. We'll put that in line. It doesn't. It's too big. It's a much bigger angle and 90 degree would be there. So I can check that one. But I can see that that one's much smaller. So it's about using your common sense as well because I can see that some of them are too small. The pentagon. It isn't, it's just bigger. So although I might have used my hand and said, oh, it looks kind of like a 90 degree angle, it's just bigger than 90 degrees, okay? Because it's a regular pentagon. Now, hexagon, what do we think? Let's have a look. Put it in line. Nope, that's much bigger than 90 degrees. They're all much bigger than 90 degrees. Okay, heptagon next. Again, this is the angle much bigger than 90 degrees much bigger okay the kite what do we think well we can see that this is much smaller can't we so we know that one isn't what about this angle let's have a look we have a 90 degree angle which is really exciting so we've got a right angle here we have got a right angle in the kite let's have a look at that one that one's much bigger because it goes much wider and so i think this one will also be 90 degrees which is really exciting so we've got two 90 degrees or right angles here 